The purpose of this video is to show you all there is to know about installing the NBC protection tent in your home. First of all, find the most suitable and convenient place to erect the tent in your house. Please be aware of light fittings, various heating appliances, and sharp instruments that could damage the tent. When choosing a place to erect the tent, please take into consideration that the dimensions of the inflated tent are 2.5 by 2.2 by 2.5 meters. It is important to measure the space where the tent is to go to make sure there is adequate room for placement of the tent and entry and exit from the tent. First of all, mark four points on the ceiling where the hooks will be placed for hanging the tent. The four marked points should create a square of 2.3 by 2.3 meters. With a 6 mm concrete drill bit, drill four holes in the ceiling to a depth of 4 cm. Then, using a hammer, insert the screw anchors into the holes. Next, tightly screw the four hooks into screw anchors. Now the hooks for hanging the tent are ready. We recommend that you install the hooks in the ceiling as soon as you receive the tent and the filtration system. Once you hear the alert in the media, take the tent out of its package and spread it out under the hooks. It is recommended that the opening of the tent face the entrance door to the room in which the tent is placed. Open the entrance zipper while lifting the tent for hanging in order to enable air to enter the tent. Lift up the tent and attach the four clasps to the hook in the ceiling. Now, adjust the support lines holding the tent to the height necessary to ensure that the corners of the tent remain on the floor. If the corners are not on the floor, continue adjusting the support lines until all corners rest on the floor. If the support line is not long enough, add and tie an extension cord as required. Now, connect the long flexible air hose to the external part of the filter base that is located outside of the tent. The other end of the flexible air hose should exit into another ventilated room. Plug the electric cord to the socket in the wall and place the components of the filtration system inside the tent. Make sure that you do not trip when entering the tent. Plug the electric cord of the blower into the electric socket inside the tent. At this stage, bring in all of the personal equipment and belongings necessary for your stay in the tent such as beverages, food, games for the children, a mattress, pillows, reading material, radio, and so on. You can also bring a television set and a telephone into the tent and transfer the cables or power cords through the entrance zipper of the tent. We recommend that you bring a chemical toilet into the tent. Bring your gas mass into the tent as well in case you have to be evacuated from the area. Enter the tent as soon as you hear an alert of an attack. Close the entrance zipper to the tent and then the Velcro. Once entering the tent, the filtration system should be installed as follows. Remove the seal from the filter and then remove the cap. Do the same on the other side of the filter. The next stage is to connect the filter to the air intake on the base of the filter. Hold the filter so that the four thin pins are facing the base. Ensure that the arrows on the sticker point towards the base and that the colored arch sticker points towards you. Place the filter horizontally to the flange. Turn it slightly to the left until the four pins enter the holes in the flange. Now, turn the filter as far as possible to the right until it locks in place. 
Connect one end of the short, flexible hose into the hole that is located in the middle of the filter. The other end should be connected to the blower. Ensure that this end of this hose is connected to the opening that is under the electric cable outlet. Now, press the on button to turn the system on. If there is a power failure, the system will automatically continue to operate under battery power for a period of approximately 10 hours. If the blower ceases to operate, there is another method in which the system should be operated. Disconnect the hose from the filter, connect the hand blower to the four pins of the filter, turn slightly to the left so that the blower locks in place, and then turn the blower as far right as possible. Hold the handle of the hand blower and pull and push the hand blower so that the air from outside is pumped through the filter into the tent. A tent that is completely inflated indicates that the system is operating properly. If the tent is not properly inflated, there could be a problem such as one of the following. The entrance zipper is not completely closed, allowing air to escape rapidly. There is a tear in the tent, allowing air to escape rapidly. The connection between the hose that connects between the filter and the blower is not properly connected. Manual operation of the hand blower is too slow. Or blockage in the air suction hose. Do not light candles or anything flammable inside the tent. Make sure that there are no sharp instruments in the tent. Pets and animals should not enter the tent unless in a special portable cage. Their claws could damage the tent. It is recommended not to place heating appliances inside the tent. Children should not be left inside the tent without adult supervision. A repair kit is attached to the tent. If it becomes necessary to use this kit, please follow the instructions. Please note, in the case of nuclear, chemical or biological warfare, the tent must not be opened and the filter should not be dismantled. Wait for the relevant instructions from the authorities. That is all you need to operate the NBC protection tent in your house. Let us hope that you will not have cause to use the system.